Welcome to Two Small Biz Guys, Biz Buds. Stay tuned for an exciting small business discussion that will empower your business. And don't forget your free download of Ray's Crib Notes. Now, on with the show. Hi, and welcome again to Biz Buzz with Ray and Zen. Yeah. And we'll give you the big introduction. Yeah, well, I'm such a small part of this play. Okay. So today we're going to be talking about, uh, again, Tribes by Seth Godin, uh, subtitled, We Need You to Lead Us. And the subject in particular we're going to talk about is leadership. Yeah, leadership, leadership and management. So one of the aspects is interest. Is, is they're not the same. No, no, they're not the same at all. At my last pro meetings, because uh, we were talking about this book, I asked each person, I said, are you a leader or are you a manager? And the question is, what is the definition of leadership? Depends on the time of day. And that's right. Yeah. Well, the, the answer that came back was in small business, and we have to serve both ways. Mm -hmm. So Golden's definition of leadership is they break the status quo. Management primarily is maintaining the status quo, improving the procedure, improving the So you're, it's your, you're the, the original heretic for your own business, or right. a disruptor, or whatever it is that you need to, to do in order to facilitate or at least acknowledge the change well, that's taking place. Years ago, when I used to have my company, and I went to a, a YPO meeting, a president's organization meeting. My people would say, when I came back, okay, what is a new idea today we're going to be doing? So basically, from the outside, ideas came back in to improve the company. So as a leader, you have to be a disruptor. You can't accept the status quo. So as a manager, your, your job is to make sure there is consistency, repetitiveness, mm -hmm. and you can depend upon what's going out or doing. So management is very important on maintaining the standards that are there. So it's kind of a good idea to the you know, phrase of management by walking around where you're looking at things, you're seeing that everything's in place, it's consistent, um, you can count on it, but then you have to ask your people, what can you do better? What do you see that we can change that'll improve our performance or that will make life better, <laughs> better in general for all of us? Well, okay, so that aspect was to change. People, a, lot of, a lot of people don't like change. And, but some people also say we need That's change. old guys, you know, we're, we're resistant yeah, to change. Yeah, I think yeah, the, you're that beer, so people are all, yeah, that, that um, is a change. It is. So the, the younger generation of millennials especially have grown up on change. And so they're, they seem to be a lot more flexible. Well, they grew up, yeah, that's true. They grew up in a, in a generation where change is constant. Uh, we grew up, or at least I grew up, in a generation where change took a lot longer. Yeah, you are a generation ahead of me. Yes, I'm a generation ahead of you. And a thought process ahead of So how is that? <laughs> but, but, but the aspect is leadership is breaking the status quo. Management is maintaining the status quo. And nowadays, it, you have to respect and encourage what he calls heretics. Yep. Heretics are ones who bring you ideas, who foster and are really change agents. And you're never too old or young to be a heretic. You see something, you, you got a question, you want to present an idea, um, do it. You know, what have you got to lose? And, and most leaders and organizations now, owners and, and such, respect that. They thrive on that, and the business does too. So one of the things that we offer, the raised crib notes on the book as well, and, and many others, <coughs> this book, you can get the, the uh, crib notes by going to peeradvisoryboard.com forward slash tribes. And seriously, you need to go there, not yet, but now. Right, better yet, very soon. And learn to be a heretic. So from a couple old heretics, thanks for tuning in. We'll see hey, you thanks for time. watching Two Small Biz Guys Biz Buzz, brought to you by Pro Peer Advisory Board. Stay tuned for more exciting small business discussions in future episodes. And don't forget your free download of Ray's Crypt Notes for this show. See you next time.